chance can't see when what deep down I felt for you Oh, I regret for losing the one who loved me Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tanika Dion. All right, um, today I actually just want to do a little small tutorial um, using the Candy K, um, the Kylie Jenner Candy K set. Now I got this about three weeks ago, the day that it came out. I just haven't used it yet. Um, I'm actually about to head on over to my son's school in about an hour and a half um, to do some parent student activities that they have put together um for us so yeah and i figured this would be perfect because it's not over the top not too bright not a lot of colors so yeah i figured i'd go ahead and use this and you know call it a day so let's just get right into it and go ahead and get started all right so i did my foundation and contour and eyebrows off camera now let's go ahead and get started with the candy k set now it says that it comes with a, a uh, eyeshadow duo, well a Kai shadow duo, blush and highlighter duo, lip liner, velvet, velvet liquid lipstick, and a matte lipstick. Okay, so <clears throat> I will go ahead and take it out. You guys don't mind my nails. I broke one and got one chipped on the side, but I'm going to get it, get them done tomorrow, which is awesome because I got a gift certificate for Christmas and tomorrow is the last day before it expires. So I have to get them done tomorrow anyway. Um, so, uh, yeah, so let's go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and start with the, um, let's see, this is the eyeshadow duo, the blush and highlight duo, and of course the lip liner, liquid lipstick, and the lipstick. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the, um, eyeshadow or Kai shadow duo the Kai. Dang. Got this stuff stuck up in here. Hold on. Go ahead and loosen all this stuff up while I am here. It is stuck stuck. Sorry. Go ahead and take it out now so I don't have to deal with it. Okay, so this is what the eyeshadow looks like. I feel like this is perfect. Definitely not too um, much to be going to go visit my son <coughs> in school. All right, so I'm going to take the darker, sorry. <sighs> Or trying to hold a mirror this and that at the same time anyway I want to take the darker shade here on the uh, crease area and above the crease and this uh, shimmer shadow on the lid of course so very very simple no cut creasing or nothing just very basic brush it on and there you go and you guys know as I say time and time again those are my favorite looks is just really basic warm colors I don't know I'm looking like I'm orange in the viewfinder and I'm not because I have no color corrector or nothing on. I used my um, Juvia's Place uh, foundation. Um, and this is in the color, what is it, Rio 430. But I find this has too much green in it. I still haven't went back to um, purchase another color. Um, I might go ahead and do that whenever. But I did use this today. And then I used my Jeffree Star concealer and powder. And this... Um, uh, BH Cosmetics bronzer that's all I have on my face right now so let's go ahead and get started and I'm going to be using this elf crease brush to go ahead and put this color in the crease it's awfully small so I mean, you may see me looking down more than usual usually I like to hold it in my hand but it's still I feel like you know just tapping off the excess excess and let's go Sorry, guys. I keep forgetting. I'm not doing this alone. Alrighty. It's 
So far so good. Very easy to apply and blending out very nicely. Very nicely. It does have a um <coughs> some fault not fallout but as you dig it dig into it you can see that there's a lot of uh powder up in there but that's okay because um there's not a lot of uh fallout falling on my face so you know that's always good yeah it's not a lot and i'm applying more than usual so you know i just want to build the color up so that you can really see it and so that i can see how blendable it is because I feel like it really is blendable so and you know I got hooded eyes so I need to put a little more in <coughs> <coughs> sorry guys and my videos this time around y'all may see a lot more coughing or sneezing or whatever I'm trying not to edit as much I want it to be as raw as possible why I don't know <coughs> excuse me but if it gets too much, of course, I'll take it out if it's, you know, too much. I know people don't want to see that. Um, but I'll be trying to get going, edit as much as possible, upload it, and keep it moving. Because this is, you know, my hobby. It's not a job. It's my hobby. You know. <coughs> so. All right. And I believe... That is about all that I'm going to put on today. And then I'm going to take my, this is the Morphe MB23 blending brush. And I'm just going to take it, no um, colors on the brush, and then just do like the outer. And to blend it out just a bit so you see no harsh lines here. That's all, nothing really. And it'll fade it out a little bit. <clears throat> you guys, this time I'm keeping this cold or cough a little bit longer than usual. Because now that I take two prescription pills, one for my um, hernia on my esophagus and one for high blood pressure, I am so nervous and scared about taking other pills. Like, I don't even want to take cough medicine because I'm so so afraid of drug interactions even though my doctor's already giving me the okay to take the medicine I can take I just I don't know so many people have died with drug interactions and I know I don't take harsh uh hard strong drugs or nothing um that can mix and kill me doctor wouldn't do that to me but I don't know I still I don't know I'm weird I guess but I don't like to take stuff and so you know I've been having this cough probably like for almost 10 days now because I won't take any cough medicine my family around here I'm getting on their nerves but I don't care I was trying to let it um <clears throat> go away naturally but obviously it seems like it's not going to do that so I may have to go ahead and take some medicine tonight because we are going to dinner and you know I don't want to be coughing on stuff you know uh in the restaurant where people are there that's gross <sighs> okay so that's all I'm gonna do for um that and then i'm going to take this sigma um e58 brush which is just like a little flat brush and i'm just gonna pack that color right here on and let's go and i just packed the brush on both sides try not to dig as much um but you know Yeah, but anyway, so like I was saying, I mean, the colors appear to be very, very, they're nice and soft, and I really like it, and um, yeah, very, very subtle. I like it. I do. Well, at least this uh, lid color is subtle. The pink in the crease is not so much, but it's still a soft look, and I like that. If I could do warm tones every single day, you guys, I'd be so happy. But I know you guys like to see that color, you know. So, it's all good. I do both. Although I prefer warm tones. So, yeah. And yeah, blending out really nicely. 
colors are really really nice I like the colors I don't have any other um, Kylie Jenner shadows um, you know never really interested but I saw this and it was just I don't know I thought it was cute I, I just thought it was cute oh yeah you know what I do have uh, Kylie shadows that I've never used in my little stand here her first two palettes whichever they were I remember getting them and they right there I can't show the camera right now don't feel like it but her first two palettes that she's ever done yeah I do have both of those never used them never and that had to be about what two years ago they sitting on you know just up there for display that's all they're up there for display if I ever did decide to use it though you know I would but I don't think so anyway guys you know I at least I'm talking I'm talking a lot but at least I'm talking while I'm doing stuff I'm multitasking today <sighs> Alrighty, that's good enough for me. I'm gonna be around a bunch of five and six year olds. I mean, parents too, but you know, I don't care about them. So, whatever. <laughs> anyway, all right. So that is enough of that as well. And this is what it looks like. Two colors, very very basic. It is what it is. I'm going to take this Morphe MB23 brush again, the one with no color, and just go a little bit more on the edges here. Just a little bit. Just to fade it out a little bit more. More pink than I like because I don't like pinky pink like that. I just, I don't like pink like that. I mean, it's an okay color, but I don't like it all like that. All right, so... <clears throat> that is enough of the um uh and i'm sorry i forgot to mention that the name of this um eyeshadow duo or kai shadow i keep forgetting it says kai shadow kai shadow duo is called candy k that's what it's called it's, come on focus candy k all right and i'm going to now go ahead and use the kylie candy k blush packaging really cute and Kylie Clay <clears throat> blush looks like this sort of looks almost identical to the um, eyeshadow it's almost identical that's pretty cool so yeah and of course I will be um, using both of these today I'm going to be using the uh, blush and the highlight so let me go ahead and get my blush brush which is the real techniques blush brush it's rubbing off because I use it so much this eyeshadow like I said it's a good eyeshadow and it blends really 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 nice it really does but it's a little too pink for me y'all it's too pink yeah that's too pink for me yeah blush is cute now i'm going to go ahead and use the highlighter with my bretman rock morphe collaboration uh, fan brush here so i'm going to go ahead and take the highlight color this brush looks stained but it's not this is clean this is the way it looks i like to do both sides on this thing too cute nice and soft oh yeah softy very cute oh that's pretty look at that sheen it even looks good on me with my textured skin yes baby mm -mm. all right that is such a pretty glow Such a pretty glow. Mm -mm. Don't know why I just did that, but yeah, nice and cute. Don't have to be too much again. I'm going around children. So 
feel like I need something, you know, and I only wanted to use just the candy K. I didn't want to use no other um, colors today. So, yeah. See, I'll see up in here. It looks like it needs something. Like, I don't know, y'all. I'm crazy. But, yeah, it's like, and I don't want to add any more pink. I just, no. No more pink. So, what I think I'm going to do is go ahead and take my, um, this uh, BH Cosmetics Brilliant Bronza and the color Coco Cutie. And I'm going to take, um, yeah, I'm going to take the Morphe MB23 brush again because it didn't have any color on it. And I'm going to add um, some, some of this bronza color just above that pink because I just feel like I don't know, it's too too much pink. I just want to bring it down even more. So just a little, just to bring it down. So I don't know. Yeah, that looks to me. I don't know if you you guys probably can't even notice the change, but I can. Yeah, that's better. Oh yeah. I like that better. That little touch of brown right there. Okay. Alright, girlfriend. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes, I like that so much better. Yes, 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 yes. Bring that pink down a bit. Mm -hmm. Bring it down. Like the pink is pretty, but for me, I don't know. It's it's too pink. It's it's just too pink. It is pretty, very nice, very easy to work with, very blendable. Um but me and my liking is just too pink. I know I keep saying that, but it is. This is so much better. I can see the difference. You guys maybe cannot, but yeah. I needed that. That's exactly what your girl needed. <clears throat> and then I'm going to actually take some of the Kylie highlighter. Again, take some of the highlighter right here. And I'm going to just put a little bit under my brow bone with... Um, the Luxie 246 Precision Crease. I'm just going to use this brush here and do a little bit of a highlight under the brow bone. Tap, 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 tap. Just a smidge. Yep, that's all she wrote. That's all she wrote. Just go back and forth a little bit, trying to blend it a bit. All right, and there you go. All right, I'm going to go in with my Hank and Henry, what is this, blickety black eyeliner. I've actually never used this before, and I know we got this in a box months ago. Y'all, whatever. So much stuff to go through. But anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and um, use this, do a little wing. And I'm going to apply these Jackie Love Silk Lashes in Buttercup. And I'll be back. Okay, so off camera, I added my lashes. Um... I added this uh, Rimmel Nude Eyeliner to my waterline because I didn't want to make it smoky so I didn't uh, put black on. I wanted to open the eyes up a bit so I just used this Nude um, Eyeliner and then I put the, um, uh, what's it called, Kai Shadow, um, the, let's see, the matte color. The matte color, I put that under the lash line on both sides and then I used the uh, Shimmer Shatter here in the inner corners and uh, under my brow bone, you saw that, and um, some mascara down the bottom. And that is all that I used on my eyes today. And now the only thing left to try in the um, uh, Candy K set is the three piece here. The lipstick, the lip gloss, and the lip liner. So, here we go. First, oh, all of it is called Candy K. Yep. So every piece here is called Candy K. Got it. Okay. I uh, guess that's why I called the Candy K set. Anyway, so we're going to go ahead with the lip liner here. Um, same as the rest of it. Sort of on the pinky nude side. So, <clears throat> alright. 
Ja. <clears throat> now I'm going in with the lipstick sorry if I didn't show you the packaging just real sleek black packaging here Kylie Jenner has her name on it like always Sorry. Oh, this is creamy. I've like three or four of her uh, liquid lipsticks. But never a lipstick. This is creamy. Mm. I didn't even read to see if this was matte or not. So I'm not sure if it's going to dry down. I don't know. Don't have time to find out. Because I'm due to leave in 30 minutes. And I still want to. Change my shirt. Excuse me. All right. Now we're going to go ahead and try the lipstick. Velvet lipstick. Okay. I mean liquid li lipstick. Pretty. All right. Mm, mm, mm. This is creamy. This is cute though. Love it. This pinky nude. This is actually, this is perfect for this look. Mm-hmm. You know, I should just wear this alone because it is creamy. I don't think it's going to dry down. I don't really don't. I don't think this is a matte lipstick. Oh, yes, it is. It says right there, matte. <laughs> I think that's what that says. Yeah, that says matte. Um, all right, I'm going to let this dry down just a few seconds. Um, all right, so it's been three whole minutes and it did dry down <clears throat> matte. Um, it's not a super matte or ultra matte or anything like that. It's just basic matte. Um, I tried a little transfer. It does transfer though. I mean, it, it's matte. It's like a semi matte, um, which is fine for me. I like it. Um, yeah, it's cute. I like it. Um, but I like mine more matte than this, but uh, it's really cute. I like this look and, you know, I have nothing bad to say because I do actually like the look, pink or not. But, um, you know, anyway, let's go ahead and try the liquid lipstick. <clears throat> Put it right on top. Um, yeah. Wait a minute, guys. You know what? I was thinking <laughs> that this was lip gloss, not lipstick. Why would I put on two lipsticks? That's crazy. Oh, gosh. I was not thinking. Yeah. Okay. Well, there goes that. Um, yeah. Well, you know what? I'm going to do it anyway. Whatever. I'm going to do it anyway. Um, but, yeah, I was thinking that this was lip gloss to put over top, not an actual another lipstick. Duh. But, anyway. I'm gonna go ahead 
Yeah. Doesn't do anything. Same exact color, so it's cool. Same exact color. All right. All right, so it's been about a whole five minutes since I put the liquid lipstick over top of the <laughs> lipstick. And actually, I actually like the way it looks, even though it's not really a difference in color, but it, it just feels more, um, I don't know, it feels more thick. Not thick, but more, um, you know, the nude that I like. Like, I, 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 I didn't have to build it up as much uh, on the lipstick. It's just, I don't know, it's cute. I feel it looks a little better. So that was everything that was in the candy case set. And I must say, I do like the way the look came out. Like I said in the beginning, it was a little too pink for me. But, you know, I made it come together. And it actually looks pretty good here. So, yeah. So I have to get, go ahead and get on up out of here, you guys. But I really do appreciate you sticking around to the end while I get ready to go to my son's kindergarten day. So, all right thank you so much for what mm, excuse me thank you so much for watching if you have not done so already please hit that subscribe button like and comment bye